Okay, the new product of the week this week is a revision. Yeah, it's a revision, but it's a pretty big revision. Uh, Rev B of the ESP32 S3 Metro. I messed up Rev A. Um, <laughs> but it's a very exciting way in which I messed it up. I accidentally used the Octal PS RAM pins uh, on the SPI port. Um, and it passed test because when I was doing my testing, I tested the PS RAM and then later tested the SPI. And I was like, oh, everything seems to be working. And if I had done that in the opposite direction, I probably would have caught this error. Um, but now it's fixed. So uh, Rev V is fixed. Moved a bunch of pins around. So just be aware uh, if you have a Rev A, uh, very f unlikely you do because we didn't sell that many before this was caught. Uh, just email um, Adafruit support and we'll send you out a Rev B in exchange. And you'll have to update uh, to the latest version of Arduino and um, CircuitPython if you want to get uh, those SPI pins and the NeoPixel updated because all those have to move around. But other than that, most of the pins didn't change. It's still, I think, a really great board and I'm glad it's out. Uh, a really good development platform for the ESP32 S3 with 8 megabytes of um, Octo PS RAM, 16 megabytes of flash. Uh, and, uh, you know, lots of add-ons, like, you know, could go off of 9 or 12 volt power, uh, the RX and TX hardware interfaces exposed, micro SD card slot, the USB type C, 7QT battery power. It has fairly good low power support on off switch. Uh, yeah, it's a nice dev board for uh, ESP32 S3 configuration. All right. And with that is... New products of the week this week. New, 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 new.